Hello class! Welcome to our English class. Good morning and good morning to your companion at home. Today we are in quarter 3 for week 6. And our lesson is about details in short stories or poems. Before we begin our lesson, let's have our lesson objectives. At the end of the lesson, the learner will be able to identify cause and effect or effect of events and predict possible ending of a story read. Okay, let's practice. Match the activities to the emotions. Okay. Number one. What will you feel when somebody gave you a gift? Do you feel sad, angry, afraid, or happy? Okay. And the correct feeling or emotion is happy. Okay, number two. What will you feel when your toy is broken? Okay, will you feel sad, angry, afraid, or happy? And the correct answer is sad. You will feel sad when your toy is broken. Number three. What will you feel when you are fighting with your um, classmate or your friend or fighting with someone? Will you feel sad, angry, afraid, or happy? Okay, and the correct answer is angry, of course. And lastly, number four. What will you feel when the home or the house is burning? Will you feel sad, angry, afraid, or happy? Okay, and the correct answer is afraid. Okay, did you get all correct answers? Oh, very good. That's great. Match the word with the pictures. These are the pictures. Look at it very carefully. And this is the word. Let's read the first word. Summer. What do you think is the correct picture that corresponds to the word summer? Okay, which picture is it? Okay, very good. This is the correct picture. Okay, next. Starving. Which is the correct picture that shows starving? Okay, great. This is the correct picture that shows starving. Okay, next is work hard. Okay, let us read again. Work hard. Okay. Where is the picture that shows working hard or work hard? Okay, very good. That is the first picture. Next is lazy. Lazy. Okay. Read it again. Lazy. Okay. Which picture shows lazy? Okay, very good. That is the last picture. And lastly, winter. Okay, again, winter. Okay, which picture shows winter? Oh, very good. That is the second picture. Okay? Story time. And for our story time, I want you to watch the ant and the grasshopper the video link is our is in our description box okay you may check it and watch the video okay 
And now, let us answer the questions with regards to the story that we have watched. Okay, number one, which character in the story played all day? Okay, very good. That is the grasshopper. The grasshopper played all day. Number two, who was hopping and singing? Okay, it is also the grasshopper. Number three, what were the ants storing for themselves? Say your answer. Okay, great. The ants storing food for themselves. So that if there is winter or when the winter come, there will be enough food for them. Okay? And number four, where did the story happen? Okay. Oh, where is the event happen? Very good. That is in the grass field. Number five, why didn't the grasshopper store food for winter? Say your answer or can you explain why? Okay, it is because the grasshopper think that during summer, there will be enough food for them or during winter rather. Okay? And he thinks that this time or summertime is for him to sing and play all day long. Okay? Number six, why, what did the grasshopper suffer from when winter came? Again, what did the grasshopper suffer from when winter came? Okay, that's great. The grasshopper suffer from starving. It is because he does not uh, have enough food for him to prepare for the winter. Or he did not store food before the winter came. Okay, number seven. From the given story, what do you think will happen to grasshopper? Okay, can you predict what will be the effect of what he do in the story? Okay, can you say the ending or can you guess what will be the ending of the story okay maybe you will say that the grasshopper will die because of starving or maybe the grasshopper will learn his lesson Number eight, what is the moral of the lesson? Okay, what is the lesson or the moral lesson of the story? Again, what is the moral lesson of the story? Okay, the moral lesson of the story is prepare. Or there is time for everything. For example, this time, the summertime is for you to prepare for the winter. For you, when there is winter or when the winter came, you will be prepared. You should not waste your time for those are not so important, okay? Or not so essential. Did you understand? Okay, 
now let's study the elements of the story. Okay, let us review. The elements of the story are characters. Okay, who are the characters? First is the ant and the grasshopper. Okay. Next is the setting or where did the event happen? Okay, where do you think the event happened? Very good. It is on the grass field. And the other elements of the story is events. Okay, let's have the events in the story that happened during the um, during the storytelling. Okay, uh, first, uh, let us read. First, an ant and a grasshopper live in a grassy meadow. The ant work all day getting food for the winter while the grasshopper played. Next, then winter came. In the end, the grasshopper had no food, but the ant had plenty of food and was happy. Okay, did you get the correct ending in the story? Okay. Very good. Uh, let us look at this picture. What does the first picture show? Okay, the first picture shows that the grasshopper is playing or singing during summertime. And let us have the second picture. What does the second picture tell us about? Okay, very good. During winter, the grasshopper is hungry or starving. Okay, these pictures shows about the cause and effect. Okay, read it again. Cause and effect. Okay, what is cause and effect? Do you know what is it? Okay, if you don't know, let us study it. Okay, cause and effect is a relationship between events or things, where one is the result of the other or others. This is a combination of action and reaction. Okay? Did you understand? Okay. Among these two pictures, which do you think is the cause? And which do you think is the effect? Okay, let's find out if you are correct. Okay. Uh, in the first picture... Ah, the grasshopper kept on playing. This is the cause. And the next picture is he has no food to eat when winter came. This will be the effect or the effect of the action. Okay. When we say cause and effect, it is the action and the reaction okay or the result of the action did you understand okay ah let us have more examples okay first picture it started raining this is the cause what do you think will be the effect of uh, Raining. Can you give an effect of this cause? Okay, the possible effect is okay, you need an umbrella. This will be 
the possible effect or um, other effect there will be flood okay or if you don't have an umbrella you will be wet or you will get wet okay did you understand okay great okay let us study further okay let us read is a reason why something happens which do you think it tells this one is it the cause or the effect okay this is the cause okay let's read again cause is a reason why something happens okay did you understand and next is the effect okay the effect is a result of what happens okay let us give emphasis when we say cause okay this is the reason reason why something happens this is the reason why something happens and next when we say effect this is a result of what happens okay did you understand okay oh for you to understand it easier uh, i will just erase these underlined words okay when we say cause this is the reason and when we say effect this is the result okay did you understand okay very good uh, let's have now predicting outcomes when we say predicting outcomes it means thinking what will happen next okay just like a while ago when i ask you to say what will be the possible ending of the story okay did you understand uh, just like this one what will be the possible outcome of the story that we have watched okay maybe the possible outcome is he will learn his lesson just like what i have said a while ago okay next it means thinking what happened next what will happen next okay for example on this picture what do you think will happen next okay the possible outcome is the boy will go to the doctor when the boy is sick and he does not uh, feel well the possible outcome is the boy needs to go to the doctor to be cured okay for our enrichment activity we will just choose the picture which shows the correct answer to each question below okay these are the pictures and the question is what happens before a rainbow appears in the sky okay uh, choose among these choices is the best or the correct answer okay and the correct answer is uh, this picture that there is 
a rain or heavy heavy rain or storm before there will be a rainbow that appears in the sky okay next number two what happens if there are dark clouds in the sky uh, choose among these pictures okay and the correct answer is this picture there will be a rain or storm when there is or there are dark clouds in the sky possible that there will be rain heavy rain or storm number three what happens after heavy rain okay what will be the possible outcome or the result or the effect of heavy rain okay very good this is the correct answer there is flood after heavy rain okay for our activity two and circle the cause number one why did ant have food during the winter season letter a he played and slept through uh, throughout the summer or letter b he worked and gathered food okay it will just encircle the letter of the correct answer is it A or B? Okay, and the correct answer is letter B. He worked and gathered food. Okay, during summer. That's why during winter, um, the ant have enough food. Okay, number two. Why was grasshopper hungry? A. He played and slept throughout the summer. B. He worked and gathered food. A or B? Okay, and circle it. The correct answer is letter A. He played and slept throughout the summer. Okay? Okay, now box the effect. Number one, ant gathered food during the summer, so A. He was hungry during the winter season. B. He had food during winter season. A or B. Okay, just box the letter of the correct answer. Okay, are you through? And the correct answer is letter B. He had food during winter season. Okay, next, number two. Grasshopper did no work during the summer. So, A. He had lots of food to eat. B. He had no food. A or B. And I box the correct letter okay and the correct answer is letter b he had no food okay for our activity one learning task three read the stories below then identify what would happen next in each situation as shown by the illustrations write the letters or le write the letter of your answer in your notebook okay uh, these are the choices uh, number one jason has a dog named bantai one rainy day it got all muddy Jason decided not to let Bantai in. 
as it might make the house dirty. What do you think happened next? Is it A, B, or C? Okay, write your answer on your notebook. And the correct answer is letter B. Of course, you will bath the, the pet or bantai. Because it is dirty and muddy. Okay, do you got it correctly? Very good. Next, number two. Paula was working on her assignment. When she finished it, her mother had already prepared their food for dinner. Her mother called her after. What do you think happened next? A, B, or C? Write your answer on your notebook. And the correct answer is letter C. Okay, for our activity 3, look at each picture. Choose the letter of the correct answer. Okay, for our activity 3, this will be your activity. You will do this and submit your output in our Google Classroom. Did you understand? Okay. Okay, number one, is it letter A, she will sing a song, B, she will cook, or letter C, she will go to sleep. I study the picture very carefully. Uh, is it letter A, B, or C? Next, number two. Letter A, the plane will land safely. Or letter B, the plane will go to Mars. Or letter C, the plane will take off soon. A, B, or C. Okay. Number three. Is it letter A, the dog will sleep? B. The dog will wag its tail. Or letter C. The dog will bark at, this, at that uh, thieves. Is it letter A, B, or C? Next, number 4. I poke my balloon with a needle. Is it letter A? I get a very wet. B. The baby cries. Or letter C, it pops. And lastly, number five. Name the red part of the sentence. Mom cooked dinner because we were all hungry. Is it letter A, cause? Or letter B, effect? A or B. Okay, if you are through, you, you may pass your output in our Google Classroom. Okay? And that's all for today. You may have your break time. And if you are having difficulties, in our lesson for today, you may watch again the part of the lesson or the whole video lesson for you to understand thoroughly the lesson that we have studied the, for this week. Okay? Thank you. Till next time. Bye-bye.